morning friends and happy Tuesday. Today is going to be a busy, hectic day for me. I'm still uh, undoing Christmas stuff, trying to decorate for Christmas. And then today I also have to pack for our business trip for the next uh, four or five days. And then I'm gonna do some laundry. So that is basically the plan of today is to get some of those things done. My first my first thing that I want to go do though is get my back room cleaned up, which is my room, my glam room, my video room, my wherever, that room, that room. <laughs> and I've also kind of got a little bit of a cold. I started coughing a little bit, so I'm kind of trying to fight that off as well, which, you know, I kind of expected to be, to kind of get sick, even though I was like constantly washing my hands on the ship and everybody else was washing their hands on the ship. Well, most people were, uh, but they make you do that before you actually go into the food area. So, uh, <clears throat> but anyway, so yeah, I kind of got to have like a dry throat, scratchy throat, coughing, uh, that type of thing, a little bit of nasal drippage. Uh, but for the most part, I'm going to get some stuff done around here, packing, laundry, Christmas decor. I want to clean up my back bedroom. This is still kind of a mess from when we... Uh, unloaded the other day. Um, <clears throat> let me turn the slide down without it being bright. Um, I knew I have my one suitcase out that has all of our toiletries in there and that's because I knew we were leaving so I didn't want to like pack all that stuff up. But the other suitcase and stuff I need to empty out because I need to just kind of put that one away and then bring out the other medium one for the stuff that we have to do for this week. So um, I'm going to go ahead and turn my TV on in here. Back to the Future is on, so I'm going to watch that throughout my house while I'm packing, cleaning, and doing Christmas stuff. So, that's what I'm going to do. So, that's what today is going to be. So, join me. Hang out with me if you want to. And, uh, yeah, let's get to... Oh, I don't want 803. Dang it. I need 80... I don't, I don't need anyone. I need 7. Oh. 7. No, no, no. Um... Where is it at? Boop, 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 back to the future. There it is. Boom. All right. So, yeah. That's what I'm going to do today. I'm excited to get some stuff done. I'm hoping to, like, make some more progress today because uh, we won't be back home until Sunday afternoon. So, and then I'll have all next week, Monday, um, all next week to finish up everything around the house. Friday night is my girls party here. Friday, also the 13th, I'm going to the UGA luncheon with um, Sandy, the lady you um, met the other day in the video. And then a bunch of other ladies are gonna go as well. And uh, yeah, so I'm kind of busy. So I will uh, catch up with you guys a little bit later and sure, share some progress with you guys. So yeah, let's go ahead and get this day started. Alrighty, so now that I have kind of cleared out all of my suitcases and all of my stuff that I that we used on our cruise and our trip last week, um, I finally dug out all of the like little souvenirs and stuff that I purchased while we were there. So I'm going to go ahead and start with the stuff that I purchased when we were on our cruise. Not very many things that I did purchase when we were on our cruise, obviously because we were limited in space and we were limited in our suitcases as well. But I did pick up a few things. The one thing I already just, I, it's in the kitchen. It's just a really pretty black wooden chalice and um, it kind of looks like the something similar that I'm going to show you here in just a second. But everything that I picked up here is from Disney, Universal, and uh, Haiti in St. Martin. So let's go ahead and I'll show you guys what I picked up at those places. Okay, so first things first, I picked up this beautiful like um, avocado smasher in Haiti and it actually says Haiti down here at the bottom if you guys can see it or not but it says Haiti down here at the bottom and then um it's really really big it's heavy and I absolutely I absolutely love it I think it's really pretty and the chalice I got is just black and it's wooden just like this and it's all trimmed out in black but anyway just pretty it's got an elephant on it it's got like a pineapple on it um, it's just really pretty I paid twenty dollars for this at one of their like little vendor shops and it came with this little smasher so I'm excited to make avocados, avocado like um, guacamole with this. Even if I don't, it's just really pretty just to have and to, to know that I got this in Haiti and it was handmade by 
one of the Haitians there. Um, then the other thing that I got was the St. Martin ornament. I absolutely love different ornaments from places that we go and visit. So I picked this one out. Um, I can't remember how much this was. Let's see, $7 for this ornament. So I just like the fact that it's got like the pine trees on it. Pine, pine trees? No. Um, what are those trees? Palm trees. Oh my gosh. Palm trees and sand. It just, again, reminds me of when we were in St. Martin. And then these are also from Haiti when we were there. These are, I don't know how they made these, but these things are amazing. They are so cool looking. And if I could zoom in on them, you guys would be able to see them a lot better. But there you go. There they are. This is what they kind of look like. It looks like a, just a bunch of paper rolled up. But anyway, I got the star one, and this was $7, and this was $7, and then I got, like, the ball one. They just are so cool looking. Very, very neat. <clears throat> Alrighty, and moving on. So I did pick up a Florida Starbucks mug because I've been trying to collect the ones from every state. And I've been to Florida a million times and just never collected one, so I finally got my Florida mug there. And then at Disney, I picked up this ornament, which I absolutely love i picked up this cute little thing which i'm going to actually probably add inside of my three-tiered tray it's so cute and it's just like a little picture it's just like a little picture so um, i got that <clears throat> of course i did get pins while i was there <clears throat> excuse me because you guys know how much i collect or you guys know how much i love my pins and i collect the pins so i got these ones right here this is the mickey and minnie christmas edition uh, I got this one. These are all the Christmas edition ones. I got this one. I got this one. I got this one. And then I did get another one and I don't know what I did with it. It's the Coronado. No, not Coronado. It's the Caribbean Beach um, signature pin from the resort. So I did get that. And then um, at Star Wars Land, I got the Baby Yoda because he's so darn cute. Absolutely love the Baby Yoda. And then I picked up this Coca-Cola uh, like detonator because obviously we weren't flying so I was able to bring it home. So I got that. So I'm never going to drink it. I'm probably just going to leave it just like this because it's so cool. Um, I also got another one but that is for a Christmas gift. Um, I also have a couple of Christmas gifts that I'm not going to share because those are for my brother and my, my his sister, excuse me, my brother and my sister-in-law and the baby. Um, these were at Universal and these are so like vintage uh, Christmas ornaments. <clears throat> so I picked up these. One of them is going to go to my neighbor across the street. I just have to decide which one. <laughs> um, it's probably going to be one of these because they're kind of very similar. So I'll probably just give her one of these. Um, and uh, anyway, but I'm going to put these on my Christmas tree. I absolutely love them because they're vintage. And then at Harry Potter, I got two shirts um, at Harry Potter, which I've already put up. But I also got this. Um, this is the... Uh, letter that was always sent to him you know to invite him to hogwarts so this is the ornament so i got this super cute i don't know how much this ornament was 17 dollars for the ornament these were a nine dollars a piece these ones and then i got a keychain as well that says gryffindor so <clears throat> i love these i love all of my little trinkets that i get from all of my places that i go and then um yeah, I don't know what I did with the other one. And then I got shirts, obviously, like I just said, from Hogwarts as well. I got one that says nine and three quarters, and then I got another one that just says Gryffindor on it. So super cute. I love those. I'm just going to wear them like with a cardigan. Love it. And then, of course, I got two more I have gifts over here. Again, like I said, those are for my brother and my sister-in-law for Christmas. And that is it. So I'm going to continue on with my day. But I did just wanted to share those with you because I knew I'm not going to sit down and do like a what I got on my trip haul type of thing. I just want to get these up and out. And so I just figured since I'm unwrapping them now, I'm just going to keep them unwrapped. I'm going to go put them on my tree and put them where they need to go and go from there. So I will check back with you guys a little bit later. Bye. Alrighty, so I moved out the chair that was right there and now I got to move this thing. I'm probably just going to get rid of that because I mean, I really don't need it. There's really nothing that I'm storing in there except for wash rags that I use for my um, makeup area here. Um, I basically just have my lamp on there and perfume and stuff. So I'll probably end up getting rid of that because it's really old anyway. <clears throat> But this is where my Christmas tree is going to go in this room. So I've kind of started moving that stuff out. Obviously, I got all this stuff together. This is our toiletries. This is what we're bringing with us 
for our little business getaway. And then um, I'm also making lunch right now. I'm actually warming up my, what am I warming up? My chili. I made chili the other day. And so I've been warming that up and eating that for like lunch and dinner, which is so nice. But I also like to make um, pasta with it. So I'm actually making a little bit of some noodles that I can put inside of my chili. So I have the chili out, I have cheese out, and I have my bowl out ready for my chili. So as soon as these are done boiling, then I'm gonna go ahead and start warming up my chili. I've cleaned up the kitchen. And then um, after I have my lunch, I will start, um, I fold, I have to fold some laundry, and then I will start doing a little bit more of the Christmas decorating around here. So I'm being productive, I'm getting stuff done. That's exactly what I wanted to do. So um, you can see too, I have, um, I need to hang these clothes up. This is something that I've already um, took out of the dryer and hung these up the other day. So these need to be hung up in Brian's side of the closet. I need to fold this stuff up and then that stuff I need to um, put hang up in my closet as well. So this is some stuff that I have to get done. I did bring my toad in here for the Christmas decorations that go on that tree. So again, I'll be slowly starting all of that. And uh, yeah, so I'm, like I said, I'm getting there. I'm being quite productive. I did hear the mail go by just a second ago, but I'm, I don't want to go outside and get it because it's cold. <laughs> How silly is that, right? <laughs> but anyway, um, all right, so I'm going to make some chili, warm some chili up, have some lunch, and then I will get back with you guys in a little bit. Bye. All right, you guys, so I have put up this tree, which is in my back room. It turned out so pretty. I absolutely love the way that it looks. I know that I have more of these little things around. So once I find keep finding them, I'm just going to just keep adding them to this tree. I actually need to go get a couple more of these little white um, like garland, pom-pom garlands, because I want to add a couple more of them to this tree. And I think that everything on this tree is absolutely gorgeous. These are the um, ornament balls that I bought yesterday at Hobby Lobby. Those are perfect. And like I said, everything is just so perfect on this tree. And I absolutely love it. This is how I always want my tree to look. It's so full and just so full of ornaments. And I absolutely love, love, love it. So I am, whew, I am wore out. And this stuff makes such a huge mess. I love this flocked tree um, and all the stuff. But it's so messy. I mean, I got it all over my shirt. I got it all over my pants. It's all over the rug, so I'm gonna have to vacuum that all up. And it keeps making me sneeze too. So, and now I have a mess in here. <coughs> Excuse me. So, yeah, other than that, I'm so excited about that. I'm so excited finally that I got this tree up. And I just gotta vacuum it around and just kinda put everything back where I got it. I need to um, set this stuff out. Oops, where are we? I need to set this stuff out. This kinda goes on the back of my little table there to set it up for like filming. I have my little snowman that I put in here. And then this is the one that I used to like sit it on. But obviously because I have in the basket, I'm not gonna be using this to set it on. So uh, yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. But anyway, cause I put it in that basket. So, and then um, all I have to do is have Brian set up the timer and then I'll just have to unplug everything from back there and he can set up the timer. That way this can come on and off. Um, on a regular basis so I don't have to keep coming in here and unplugging it so yeah so now I'm gonna vacuum and I'm gonna put this stuff out and then uh yeah I should be good getting a lot accomplished which is great I hear my dryer okay bye all right guys so I'm gonna go ahead and end the vlog here today I have been super busy today just trying to get so many things done in one day. Um, I'm actually gonna sit here and fold some laundry while this video uploads and then I can get it edited and up for you guys tomorrow. We leave tomorrow for Huntsville for the next five days. We won't be home until Sunday afternoon. I will definitely try my best to get videos up while we are gone. If I cannot, I do apologize for that. They will be up starting on Monday. So. With that being said, I will see you guys tomorrow in my vlog because I will be vlogging every single day, 
even though it may not go well because of the Wi-Fi. But anyway, all right, thanks for hanging out with me today, guys. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you did, huge thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, and please share with a friend. I definitely would love to see my uh, subscription, my subscriptions, my subscriber count grow. Um, that would be such a nice like thing to see. So uh, thank you guys so much. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.